A majority of the four million farms in Brazil are small farms known as family farms. These family farms produce 70% of the country's um, consumption and also employ about three quarters of the farm labor force. The Drone Technology Development Program for Precision Agriculture aims to demonstrate how Qualcomm's drone technologies can be applied to reduce environmental impact and increase crop yields for Brazilian farmers. The farmer could view the data in real time directly streamed from the drone on say a tablet or smartphone like device or a PC as well. My name is Chad Sweet, I'm a Director of Engineering. I'm the project engineer for our drone and robotic R&D efforts in Qualcomm Research San Diego. That same data could also be collected for more temporal or historical analysis in the cloud. So giving the farmer perspective as, uh, as to how the analytics are changing over time, either over the weeks or the months or even over past years and past seasons. Qualcomm Wireless Reach is collaborating with the Brazilian Agricultural Research Corporation, also known as Embrapa, um, which is affiliated with the Ministry of Agriculture. Currently in Brazil, there are researchers and engineers that are um, using Embrapa's expertise in agriculture and image processing algorithms combined with the strong performance of Qualcomm Snapdragon flight drone platform and advanced wireless technologies to develop onboard systems for drones. We looked and saw all this great stuff we had done in integrating this sophisticated high compute uh, capability into the processor to fit in a nice, thin, long battery life smartphone. Really, all of that was directly applicable to drones. And anything that wasn't, we actually repurposed specifically for drones. So, in creating the Snapdragon Flight, which the Embrapa Group is leveraging here, we were really looking to pack as much computing power directly applicable to drones into as small and lightweight of a package as possible. In the next phase, once the drone technology is developed, we aim to work with a local nonprofit in Brazil called the Institute of Solidarity Socioeconomics to use this technology um, with several family farms in order to do field testing of the technology. Um, this will allow us to improve the technology but also measure the social and economic uh, impact for these small family farms. To see some of these more uh you know, agricultural and inspection-based use cases come to life is, is really, really neat. We spend a lot of time in the lab brainstorming how this technology could be used. It's really exciting to see this actually play out now after all these years of, of working on it. The team has a, a big focus on community enablement in general, and this is the exact type of thing we're hoping can come from this.